Good morning gamers and welcome back to a new episode here in Russian Survival. Today we're gonna be cutting down some grass, finally. I know it's been so long, every single episode we're cutting down trees, but don't you worry. On this episode, first thing we're gonna be doing, cutting down some grass. So let's get our nice Massey Ferguson started. Drop this down. Grab our new mower. And let's see what you got. Okay guys, well um, I'm gonna go ahead and mow down all these grass. I hope you enjoyed the time lapse and I'll see you when I'm done. Alright guys, well that's both field cut. Now we'll grab the wind rover, which is at the store. So I'll drive on there and I'll see you down there.
All right, so we got it. I'll bring it back down and uh, make some rows. Then we'll come back and grab the loader. And uh, we'll grab some uh, grass. Probably sell one log just so we can buy, you know, maybe two logs just so we can buy a silage pit so we're not just dumping the grass on the ground because we could sell it potentially but the price isn't really that good I would rather make silage out of it and then sell the silage because we can get like three times the amount of money for it so it's worthwhile to put down a silage pit we're gonna have to sell two trees though Hopefully I can make it by the end of this episode. But anyway, we'll windrow, we'll windrow it now, and then uh, we'll see how much time we got left. We're up for ado. I'll see you when it's all uh, nice, and neatly packed. So we got the uh, whole wind rowed up. I need to go and get the... What's it called again? <coughs> the loading wagon. I need to go and get the loading wagon. Once I got that, uh, we'll come back here, go to sleep, wake up to a new day. Just gonna check really quick the prices of sugar beets before we go to bed. 393 Oof. we should actually sell those sugar beets let's get that done all right so I'm not going to get the loading wagon we're gonna dump those um, potatoes we're gonna go sell those potatoes make some well-deserved money thanks to the farmer that was here before us that left it there who knows how old they are but yeah I think maybe we'll get uh, three or four grand out of it and that is definitely gonna come in handy Alright, so let's see how quick I can uh, pick all these sugar beets up. I'll see you when I'm done.
So we got uh, just over $3,000 for that. Not bad at all, considering that we hadn't we didn't even have to do anything for it. That brought us up to four grand, which means that next time that we sell a tree, we're going to be able to buy... Oh no, we need to buy... We need to sell two trees, uh, maybe even three, to get the 4x4 four four trailer. Hmm. Because once we buy that 4x4 four four trailer, we're most probably going to be able to bring two or three trees at a time. Which is going to make a lot of a difference. <laughs> I can basically do what I did in two episodes. I can do it in one. So we really need to get that 4x4 four four trailer. I think hopefully that's going to be for the next episode. Now that we actually cut down the grass. Finally we had an episode where we're not cutting down trees. Oh, you know what? I can actually go and pick up that uh, harvester too. It's not a harvester, sorry. Loading wagon. Because this trailer has a tow hook. Hopefully it's the right one. But we'll give it a go. So yeah, as I was saying, we really need to get that um, 4x4 trailer. It's going to be such a great addition to our farm. Really speed, speed things up. And it's going to be our next priority. Though we still haven't put a crop into the ground. Oh, that's some good trailer backing right there. Choo choo! <laughs> oh, this road is so open quote muddy close quote the mud is basically made out of stone but nevertheless this map is really nice i really like the feature you know having to drive around mud holes and stuff it's you know quite a simple thing to add to your map and it gives that sort of you know real feeling to it and this map absolutely it looks absolutely stunning. Like, I love it so much. It looks so beautiful. And we've only explored our little plot of land there. Still haven't gone around the map to see what's around. I guess uh, at the beginning we're just trying to get our foothold, starting to make some uh, some money, you know. But once we got our farm going and we are, you know, we're waiting for things to grow and uh, animals to produce, I guess we can uh, go and take a stroll around with the ape, go and check out all the different parts of the map. Oh, you can do it. You can do it, little Ferguson. This Ferguson is a beast. That's how you do it. Keep on trucking. Cool guys. Well, I'm gonna end that episode there. I really hope you enjoyed it. Hope you enjoyed the fact that I didn't cut down any trees. But don't worry, that's gonna come back in the next episode. <laughs> Um, if you liked it, you know what to do. If you disliked it, you know what to do. Comment if uh, you have any suggestions. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.